gentle and very intelligent. The mountain gorilla is a top attraction. The endangered apes can only be found in the wild in Uganda, Rwanda and the Democratic Republic of Congo. Conservationists say consistent and sustained conservation efforts are now paying off. When we did the census in 2011, we found that in Buindi, the numbers were 400, had gone from 300 to 400, which is very exciting, and Burunga was 480. So the total has always been 880 as an up-to-date information. But now with this new information, the number has now gone up to over 1,000, so we're very excited. <laughs> Using high-tech equipment, these truckers are able to gather enough information about the gorillas. They record the individuals that have been sighted, that they record any health condition they have seen. Uh, they record any unusual behavior that they have seen, uh, even pred predators, uh, illegal activities, everything. The scientists also carried out genetic analysis from fecal samples collected from nests to ascertain the actual numbers. We were able to start picking up more gorillas through genetic studies. Where genetic studies began about the last census, the last two censuses have had genetic studies, where then with a the dung you're able to tell who is the father. However, despite the increase in the numbers of gorillas, conservationists are concerned about the shrinking habitat for gorillas due to population explosion. Mountain gorillas contribute a bigger percentage in tourism revenue to Rwanda, Uganda and the DRC. Now, to sustain this important source of income, the three countries are paying key attention to the protection of the endangered species. Hilara Isga, CGTN, Kampala.